Okay, now um, the turkey is still browning. It's going to take a little bit, but what I'm going to show you now is the other ingredients. I've got the turkey in my big pot, and these are the other ingredients aside from the meat. I've got two, let's see, what's the ounces on this? I've got two 15 ounce cans of the dark, uh, you think this was my first time. They're the dark red kidney beans. Now I know some people drain, but I don't because these beans are a little hard. They need to cook. You know, this is something that um, you can let it cook for a long time, and it's okay. And I've got some bushes beans. I always like to add bush beans, and you know, they're baked beans, so they have their own sugar. So I think I'm going to drain some of, let's see, let me get something here. I'm going to drain some of this off. may not want all that sugar, but I do want the beans. I usually like uh, two or three kinds of beans in my chili, but not today. Today, as I said, I've got the dark, dark red kidneys, and I've got tomato. I've got tomato sauce. Now, tomato sauce, I would suggest adding half the can because this is the large can. Add half. I like my chili thick. I don't like it soupy. So, uh, this, this is my lifesaver. This is the Hormel chili, no beans. So, in a pot like this, I would do two two cans now there has been times when I've been making uh, I've been making a bigger pot and I would use more but this will be fine for this okay came right out. And, and you'll see, this will give you a nice, rich, uh, nice, rich chili. Now, the garlic powder and the chili powder, I wait until the meat has cooked. And then I add those. Because remember, you're going to combine all your ingredients in this pot. And it's going to cook for a while. You're going to put it on low heat, and then you're going to cook it. So, you've got your bush beans, and this is the 55 ounce uh, can. You've got two of the 15 ounce cans of dark kidney beans. You've got large can of diced tomatoes, and you've got a large can of tomato sauce. So, now I also add a packet of the chili mix. Now, I've had a lot of people ask me, how, why, how do I get my chili so thick and rich? And how is it that it has such a rich body? And that's because of what you see here. I add chili pack. Now a lot of people would only add this with tomato sauce and that would be their chili. No. I like it nice and rich and thick and it'll be delicious. Now of course you want to add a uh, uh, little brown sugar and you can put that right in this pot. Over that air. Okay, 